Voter registration has ended its second phase with more registration centers being made available. In phase one, people were expected to register at one center, which is in Bari. However, now they can register at multiple centers close to their residential areas and places of work. This is a welcome development and dismisses any excuse for people to fail to register to vote. Few Kings is back. Ten Diamond, Junior Brown and Take Fizzle hit us with a 13-track album titled The Feeling Ain't Fear. The album so far has been receiving nothing but positive vibes on social media. If you want a copy of the album, be sure to like their page for details. Dove is in trouble after launching a racist online ad campaign. In an image from the ad posted online, you can see a black woman removing a top and turned into a white woman, indicating that after having used the lotion, the melanin pigment vanishes and turns white. Dove has since issued an apology via Twitter and the image has been taken off Facebook. It's hard being black and beautiful when mainstream media and corporations want to make you feel you're inadequate. Racism and colorism have long plagued our communities and more should be done to eradicate and shame this illness. Seems like it's comeback season as Mariachi is also back with a single produced by Fun F called Shama Time. The single features Goldfinger and King Active. Mariachi really does come hard on them bars. Better look for that and listen to it. And on a sad note, we recently lost one of our young and bright future leaders. Tinashe Chueche, founder of Harare Tees, lost his life to an act of violence. Apart from being a friend, he was such an amazing being and very passionate about his business. My deepest condolences to Tendaim Chena, the rest of his family and fellow comrades. We shall sorely be missed. So for these and other stories, be sure to follow us on Facebook, The Juice, Twitter at The Juice, Instagram at The Juice, or visit our website, thejuice.co.zw.